Now I work with open education in the web. I participate of a community of open educational resources. Um, and we believe that material from education and for education are free and it belongs to everyone. Mm, no one is the owner of the uh, of the knowledge. Knowledge is it, it belongs to everyone. Of course it's necessary to pay the person that creates something or to recognize that the person they did that thing but it's not the same that the property. So we think that material from for education have to be free. And so we work for published things in the internet in open formats and open licenses. And it's very important here in Brazil and I think in Pakistan too because we Brazil is now a rich place but richness it's not for everybody there are a lot of poor people in our country and the knowledge it's not accessible for everyone we believe that with the networks and the internet it can be easier to access knowledge because of this we say it's free it's for everybody another thing I do in the internet it's about feminism, it's about the woman power, especially about maternity. When a baby is born here in Brazil, the most part of the births are from cesarean births. And more than 80% of the births are cesarean, not 8, 80. <laughs> and it's too much. Uh, that's because the money that the doctors and the healthy plans earn with this not about the woman not about the baby and a lot of women feels this like a violence and a lot of babies born before it's time and it's bad for their health is too and when I was pregnant for the first time because I have two babies I knew by the internet a group of women that do different that believes in the natural births and try to do things like women do since we are humans and because of this I had the two natural birth borns and it was because of the internet too